So I'd like to welcome our next field gentleman, Myra Duckworth. <laughs> Myra's been a teacher since 1996. She's also a self-published author, life coach, NLP practitioner, and autism mum. She's here with her speech titled, The Me in Memory. Please welcome Myra Duckworth, everybody. <laughs> Some very strange things have been happening to me recently. I'm in the shower and I finish off, turn off the taps, slide open the shower doors and reach out for my towel. And it's not there. And I think, I could have sworn I brought my towel down because you see my bathroom is downstairs so I shout out to the kids in the front room kids yeah <laughs> is my towel in there no could one of you please run upstairs and grab it for me yeah sure thanks it's my kids <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I'm in the kitchen and I'll be washing up, start to dry, pick up a tea towel and think, that don't smell too happy. <laughs> I might just run upstairs to the airing cupboard and get a clean towel. So I run upstairs and I get to the top of the stairs and I think, what am I doing up here? And I cannot remember what I went upstairs for and what is really strange is I have to go all the way back to the kitchen and suddenly I'm like oh went upstairs to get the tea towel <laughs> I've got to go all the way back upstairs to get the tea towel now is that just me or has anybody else had that yeah, yeah, yeah. oh there's a few people <laughs> another one standing in front of a beautiful audience of people doing a wonderful speech, nailing it, get right to the very end and suddenly I completely... completely forgot my words. Anybody else had that or is that just me? <laughs> Last year I did some market research about memory loss. Actually it was about dementia. And they told us in that session that it was believed that dementia was actually an illness for the aged. Then they added that it was now presenting in people as young as 35. Could you stand up please if you are 35 or over? And that's me as well. I know it's difficult to see but if you can just look round and just look at how many people in this room could possibly already be presenting with early stages of dementia. Thank you. Could you just take a seat? It's quite serious. And then a few months after that, my nan passed away from dementia. That was one of the reasons why I was chosen to attend the market research. And I just want to dedicate tonight's speech in memory of my nan and also in honour of my mum and her sisters who had a really tough time caring for my nan during those final stages. Does anybody else know anybody who may have suffered with dementia? Who do you know? Your grandma. Somebody up there put their hand up. Who do you know? Grandma Your grandma too. So it's quite common and it's very tough and it's very tiring and it tugs on your heartstrings. But what I also learned on the market research is that there is something you can do about it. On the one hand, you can be social, get out, meet people, do things, 
Try something new. You can be active, go out and ride a bike, walk in the fresh air. Play new games, even board games. You can eat a healthy diet. It's a difficult one, but I'm sure we all know what a healthy diet means. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get lots of good quality sleep. And the last one is actually use your memory. Let's try to stop relying on gadgets and gizmos and actually try to commit things to memory. Or, of course, on the other hand, you can do nothing. But don't be surprised if dementia creeps up on you and steals your memory. Your memory is so important. That is where your identity is stored. That is where your memories are stored, your relationships with other people, who you are, who other people are to you. Imagine for a moment looking around the room and not remembering who anybody was. Imagine for a moment not even remembering where you are. Imagine for a moment looking in the mirror and not even recognising yourself. So my challenge for you this evening is this. Who will join me on stage and commit to looking after their memory? One or two people, maybe, come up and join me. Thank you. And if we just stand in a semicircle. Oh, lots of people. Everyone. Thank you. <laughs> we'll have some on that side as well. We're just going to make a semicircle. Thank you. And if you just repeat after me, I commit, I commit to looking after my memory. Looking after my memory. Because, because I am, I am the me. In memory. In memory. Thank you. 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 Thank you.